Hello, what's up? What's happening? What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, the TSU Tigers are going to be taking on North Texas. We are the home team. Now, we lost to Texas, and we kind of thought that that was going to happen, even though we did try our hardest, because we ain't no suckers, okay? We are going to play the way that you should play, and that's trying to win and put your best foot forward each and every game. Then we took on Grambling State. I wasn't quite sure how we were going to play. I figured that that would be a good uh, a good game for us to get a win. Grambling State is kind of in the same boat as us, so I figured if we execute, we would get the win, and that's exactly what happened. But now it's North Texas. North Texas is, of course, a D1 school. I was not quite sure how this game was going to play out. I did think that if we do what we're supposed to do, of course, we can win this game but i did not know how much of a talent gap there would be for either side we have a bunch of guys that can run fast on the receiving side of the ball and our quarterback is a speed demon as well i would like to see if our running game could get going the past two games the running game has been non-existent we have kept with the ground game in this dynasty, we're probably going to pass a lot more than we do in like NCAA 06, where the running game to me is king. But in this game, it might be a pass first approach, but we still want to use the running game. We don't want to become one dimensional. So hopefully we can establish the run today. Hopefully we can win. It's going to be our second straight home game. North Texas, TSU. Let's get it. The Tigers are going to be on defense first. North Texas, they're going to get the ball first from their own 10. And he's going to weave through traffic a little bit. And Dukes is able to bring him down at the 40-yard line. So good return for North Texas to kick things off. Then Ingram gets brought down by the homie Brown. Loss of four. Second down and 14. That's going to be caught by Johnson. Love is there for the stop. And that's going to be a first down. No, it's going to be just a solid game. Not quite a first down. Yates, he's not even going to get a first down. So fourth and inches. And now they do pick up the first down, taking it right up the gut. Now, you saw Ingram's numbers. He's like 28 of 80 so far this season. No TD passes and four interceptions. So the best bet for North Texas might be to keep it on the ground. And that's what they're doing so far today. So third down and five. That's going to be broken up. Another fourth down. And they're going to go for it again. Ingram looking downfield. And we I thought that was going to be a broken up pass. I thought we were going to put our hands on that football, but we didn't. Jones makes the catch right there. And now it's going to be second down and one from the gun. Ingram to the flat. It's going to be caught by Gross. Brought down by Young. Good tackle. Third down and two. Yates. He breaks a tackle in the backfield. You ain't going to get away from everybody, baby. That's Wiser with the stop. And now they got to set up for a field goal. Kick is up. Kick is good. So here come the Tigers on offense. Going to hit him with this option. And that's a disaster. The ball is loose. Luckily, though, we are able to jump on the football. Wilshire. Looking downfield, and Wilshire's pass hits the grass. So third down and nine, and this boy can run, though. Wilshire's going to take off. He's going to pick up the first down. He's going to pick up much more. Steps out of bounds at the 47-yard line. So first down and 10 going over the mill. Caught by Sanders, our big tight end. Remember, the tight end's going to get a lot of play in this dynasty. That's not what I thought was going to happen. But with Ethan Ford out, that's what's going to happen. Armstrong makes the catch right there. We get the ball to Longshore on first down. He just got his stick, and that's going to do it for the first quarter of play. So now we're in the second quarter. It's time for us to establish that ground game a little bit more, and that's not happening. We get hog tied down. Third down going downfield to, Ant to Armstrong. I'm about to say Anderson, but that's Armstrong. That's holding on the play. He dropped the football. They were declining the penalty. So it's fourth and six. We go to Armstrong, who makes the catch, but he had to go to his knees. So he's down right there. And the ball goes back to North Texas. What can our defense do? So far, not too much. Gross, he makes the catch right there. Picks up a good gain of eight on first down. Second down and two. Yates takes it right up the middle, right in between our D tackles. And that's going to lead to a first down. Eddie Weiser gets banged up on the play. Our defense, we are very multifaceted, if you will. We go with the 3-3-5 scheme. Then we also have a 3-4 scheme, a 4-4 scheme, and a traditional 4-3 scheme. All right? All right. So third down and one. We have three down linemen. Probably sure went with four or five of them things as they pick up the first down by the hairs of the chinny chin chin. Yates, he gets the carry, and that's his best carry of the ball game. All of his carries have been consistently good, but that was the best one right there from the 27 play fake ingram takes a shot downfield that's gonna be incomplete ingram going towards the end zone and that's gonna be broken up by robinson i see you boy third down and 10 they test robinson again and this time jones makes the catch 
and that's going to be a first down. Ingram looking downfield. That's going to be, should have been caught, but it's incomplete. Robinson with tight coverage. Then we get into the backfield. Hands bro with the stop. And now it's third down going to the end zone again. Maybe that should have been caught, but Robinson had tight coverage. And that's going to lead to an incompletion and lead to a field goal. Kick is up. And the kick is going to be good. So North Texas, they take the lead. Or they already had the lead, and now they just add to the lead. 6 nothing to the score. Cross at his own 10, up to the 20. He gets crossed to 40, crosses to 50. He could take it to the crib, down to the 20. 10-5, touchdown, T-S-U. So we get on the board via the kick return. That's what we need, baby. We need all the breaks that we can get. Second down in inches. Ingram looking downfield, still looking, takes a shot deep, and that's going to be caught by Jones. I probably should have took control of Robinson right there. I wanted to see what the CPU was going to give me, and they gave me nothing. But look at that big hit by the homie Hawkins after a gain of three. It's second down and seven. Dropping back the pass is Ingram. That's going to be caught by Jones. Caught it by the shoelaces. My goodness gracious. That was down to the ground. Ingram over the middle, caught by Yates out of the backfield. And that is going to be another scoring drive. So 13 to 7 is the score. Armstrong is like anything Cross can do, I can do better. Armstrong to the 50, and then I step out of bounds. I did not do that on purpose, ladies and gentlemen. I was just trying to, I was just trying to go down the sideline, but I hit it too fine, if you will. So second down and 12 after the sack. Looking downfield is Wilshire. Stopping, popping, going downfield for Thompson, who makes the catch and we are inside the red zone 15 seconds to go Wilshire's going to take it himself that's going to be a touchdown T TSU we ain't going away baby it has been tough sledding but the last two matter of fact our last drive was a good one the last kick return was a good one the one before that was a great one and now we have the lead just like that man but this is going to be a tough second half that's just the gut feeling that I have Wilshire going over the middle that's going to be dropped by Thompson we need something to go our way third down and nine from the gun Wilshire he's going to roll out he's going to take it himself he picks up the first down slide safe and that's going to be a fresh set of ten Wilshire, look at that option. Great execution, and that's another first down. Ball's at the 48-yard line of North Texas. Under pressure is Wilshire, and down he goes. And now we're back on the other side of the 50. Second down in 13. Wilshire, he is under pressure, and he's not going to get away from the rush. That's going to be a sack by Gonzalez, and now we are looking at a third and long. Third down and 30 from our own 32. Trying to get a little cute. And that was a no-no as we fumble the football and North Texas jumps on top of it. They get the ball to Yates. Witherspoon is there for the tackle. Big 78, baby. They're going to go with the ground game. No, it's a play fake. They should have ran that ball because Robinson straight hating. 30 up to the 40. Crosses the 50, and we are back in North Texas. Our defense stepping it up today, baby. That's what I like to see. This game is going back and forth, but right now it's turning into a defensive struggle. Huge hit on Longshore. They bring the pressure again, and again, we're having a hard time blocking the pass rush. Wilshire looking downfield, has some pressure in his face. That pass falls incomplete, and we go three and out after the INT. Yates gets the carry, gets brought down by Hawkins. Second, day, excuse me, by Walker, 97, not 27. That's going to be a good carry by Ingram, who does get brought down by Hawkins right there. Ingram over the middle. That should have been caught by Jones, but he forgot his hands back in the dorm room. Ingram going to the right side. That's not going to work neither. So third down and 10. They were running the ball in the first half. They've gone away with that here in the second half, and they might want to go back to it as that pass falls incomplete. We get something going on the ground, gain of eight. Now we're going to give the ball to Henderson, and Henderson didn't get no help from his fullback. Third down and five. Wilshire under pressure as our left tackle is looking up at the sky, and that's going to be an interception. There was no receiver over there. We tried to throw it behind Rodgers, but instead we throw it right to Rodgers, and now North Texas has a great opportunity with prime field position, but they're going to let that great opportunity go as Felder gets the INT. That's what I'm talking about, and that's going to do it for the third quarter of play. So the defenses have turned things up here in the third quarter, in the second half. Will that stay true here in the fourth quarter? Henderson gets the pitch, goes backwards, loss of one. Second down in 11, going downfield, and that's going to be, it should have been caught by Armstrong, but it's going to be dropped. Third down in 11. We have some time. We're going to roll out, looking downfield. I thought Dukes was going to keep going. He did not. 
And now we could be in trouble because they're going to have good field position. They fake the end around. Yates still has it. Yates is down the sideline. Yates is being chased by Cross, who pushes him out of bounds at about the one-yard line. They run the ball up the gut. Yates is in there for another touchdown. They decide to go for two. And the two-point conversion is going to be no good. He had it, but the hit jarred the ball loose. So we go up the gut with Guy Longshore, and Guy's getting put on his butt. Second down and 12. We try to run a screen pass. It took too long to get set up, and we take a sack. Third down and forever. Wilshire going downfield, caught by Dukes. And we're going to be two yards shy of the first down. So we go for it on fourth and two. Wilshire got the speed. You ain't going to spot him. That's a no-no. We pick up a first down. We're inside the 40 in North Texas territory. Guy Longshore looks to be shaken up on the play. So bring in Henderson after the gain of one. Second down and nine. Wilshire. He's going to roll out and use his feet to pick up the first down. Excellence is in that boy's toes. Yes, I said that. Henderson going to take that thing up the gut for a gain of one. Wilshire going to roll out again. He's going to stop. He had room to run. Instead, he throws the football. And that was third down and nine. Throwing it downfield, and that's going to be incomplete. So fourth and nine, we got to go for it because it's not quite in field goal range. Henderson makes the catch. Perfect pass by Wilshire, and now it's a first down. That pass falls incomplete. Second down and 10. A minute 28 to go. We can go with the direct snap. Henderson gets nothing. Third down, 10 yards to go. Wilshire over the middle to Sanders, and that pass falls incomplete. So now it's fourth down, 10 yards to go. Going to the end zone, and Armstrong drops another one. Minute 06 on the clock. Mathis gets the carry. Picks up a solid gain of six. We burn a timeout. Second down and four. Yates picks up the first down, but there's a flag on the play. Clipping on the offense. So we are going to accept the penalty, but the clock is running. So there's 40 seconds to go. 41 seconds to go. We burn another timeout. Third down and 12. Yates gets the carry. He drags Weiser, who's back in the ball game, but he does make the stops. So we have no timeouts. 28 seconds on the clock. Wilshire takes a shot deep to Wilson, who's not going to catch up to that bomb. Second down and 10. 24 seconds on the clock. Rolling out, waiting, firing over the middle. That's going to be caught by Dukes, who gets free. Finally gets brought down at the 32-yard line. 13 seconds on the clock. Wilshire steps up in the pocket, lets it fly. That's going to be caught by Dukes. Seven seconds on the clock. From the seven-yard line, the clock is now running. Last play. We enter the backfield. Wilshire looking. Wilshire decides to tuck it a run. Touchdown, T-S-U. And just like that, as quick as a hiccup, we come back after being down by what? By about five points. We had to give the ball right back to North Texas with less than a minute to go. We get a stop. We have no timeouts, but in four plays, we drive the length of the field for a game-winning touchdown. I was not expecting that, ladies and gentlemen. That's the number one classic game of this dynasty, of this video game right here. That was incredible, bro. That that was really, really incredible, man. So, Wilshire, he was Mr. Do-It-All. He ran the ball 15 times. Now, a couple of those were sacks, or a lot of those were sacks, I should say. But his feet are definitely a difference maker because our receivers are good. Like, they, our receivers are fast. <laughs> Let me say that. Our receivers are definitely fast. Catching sometimes is an issue for them. Uh, but I do have faith in my receiving core. I do believe that our running game will pick up at some point. I just don't know when. Our next game is versus Texas A&M, so it ain't going to get no easier. We could be taking the L, but like I said, man, we're going to try our best to get a W in that one. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope that the rest of the day is the best today. Y'all stay safe out there. It's a crazy world that we live in. And until we meet again, my friends, peace, love, hot sauce.